Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Tulsa and today we are back with another Final Fantasy Brave Exodus video and today we're gonna cover the in-game news that got released and right here, right here, sorry, you guys can see that the story event out for vengeance, we will get, be getting the extra stages on Thursday after maintenance. So basically this is a nice way to farm a little bit more lapis and also those beautiful crisps and uh, make sure you do farm those because uh, we're supposed to get maybe ability awakenings this month for Sephiroth, Leela, Atoning Dragoon Kane, and some other characters. But if you guys want to make sure uh, that you're full of Christ, go for this because this is going to be really, really good. Also, Steel Castle Melfica will be up, and you guys will be able to basically get the level 4s for your great swords, uh, daggers, throwing weapon, and also katana. So this thing is really, really good since uh, you guys know. We got Esther, she uses Greatsword, and now we got Zeno and Axtar, which use Katana. So you guys make sure that you farm these things right here to put on your Greatswords and also on your Katanas to make your characters even that much stronger. And uh, let's be honest, this is always good, especially for all the uh, rewards and stuff like that. Hopefully, they will not be giving us another Bowie Knife, because uh, it would be really good. I know I'm scrolling down for no reason. But uh, th these are the things you might get. So make sure you, uh, you if you want to order your tickets for future characters, go for it. And also, please do not give me a Bowie knife or uh, the rod for uh, from Ark, the Trust Master from Ark. All right, the Omni Rod. All right, so give a, give us something different. I don't know, something really good. Please, game, give us something really good as a free reward. Then we're also gonna have a new step up banner. Uh, basically, this one is for these featured characters right here. They're from the story. Naji, Yego, Zululu, and Delulu, and also Gallus, which uh, has a really good TMR, this guy. Uh, she uses a whip. She's special, and uh, they're crazy. So that's, uh, that's how I'm going to put it. But yes, we got, what was it? Three amazing banners in a row with Esther, Sylvie. Uh, then we got Golbez, which is still a really good uh, damage dealer, magic damage dealer. And also, now we just got Axtar and uh, Zeno of the Battlestar. So this one is kind of on the low thing of things. But let's go over their stuff. For a grand total of 12,500 Lapis, you guys will be able to pull on that step up. It's limited to one per player. And basically, uh, the rates are up for these characters on that banner. So if you're pulling, pulling right here, sorry, you will not be getting any rates up for uh, Yego, only for Naji. So for 12,500 Lapis... This is what you guys are getting. You're going to be uh, guaranteed a 5 star at the end. Alright, with a 5 times rate up for Naji. And uh, something really cool on step 4. Uh, I think they're getting accessory and uh, basically a weapon. So that's really, really cool. That's something that they can do in the future. Basically for some units that are getting released. And especially Yego, since not a lot of units are using whips. And there's not that many great whips in the game. Uh, if they can make this one really, really good for her, then it could be something pretty, pretty cool. So let's go over Naji right here. Global upgrade, super trust, master reward, yin yang dual hand, boost attack and magic by 40%, and boost equipment, attack and magic when armed with two one-head weapons. So that's pretty good. If you guys are going to put this on your Ivory damage dealers, uh, this will be really, really good. Character like Veritas of the Light could greatly, greatly use this to deal even more damage then trust master reward black fox shapeshifter mask this is really good it's a hat attack 40 magic 40 defense 10 and spirit 12 so this thing is actually really 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 nice uh, featured abilities projection dance of destruction uh, deal dark damage to one enemy global upgrade clad and power seven star one use every five turns basically boost own attack and magic and reduce ice wind light and dark resistance for all allies uh, I don't know. We're gonna wait for the data mine. If something like uh, a boost of 150% and uh, you do 100% in peril, that could be pretty, pretty good and devastating. Then she gets projection. Dance of Darkness, 7 star. Deal dark damage to all enemies. So that's all we know. Uh, so Naji, thank you for showing up. Alright, then we're gonna move on to the next one, Yego, which is a pretty cool unit. And a pretty cool character in the story if you guys are there right now. So we're Super Trust Master, the Fast Lash. It's a whip, two-handed weapon, attack 176. So that's pretty good. Uh, and that's a global upgrade. Uh, no, global upgrade. The Trust Master reward. 
Whip Expert, boost MP by 20%, boost attack by 50% when equipped with a whip, and boost equipment attack when a single weapon is equipped in both hands. So since this is a two-handed weapon, if you guys get four of her, well, get that Super Trust Master. Unless nobody else puts her as a friend. So make sure, make sure you keep two of her. Just saying. Then her featured ability, ability, sorry, Toxic Whip. One use every three turns. Chance of instantly you KO instantly, instantly, whatever. Chance of KOing or damaging and dealing great gradual damage to all enemies. Then she gets a global upgrade. Brutal Whip deal earth damage and reduce earth resistance for one enemy. Ground Whip deal earth damage and reduce earth resistance for one enemy and fill L uh, fills own LB gauge. So I'm gonna have to look up a little bit more into her and Naji to see exactly how they work and I'm gonna go on the Japanese side to see exactly how they work a little bit because we never know they might change stuff from the Japanese side to the global side. I know my hand is not on screen but just in case. Then we get our four star into six star Zululu and Dululu. Uh, these ones are actually pretty funny in the story. So trust master reward two for one boost attack by 20% boost SPR by 40% when equipped with an instrument and boost attack by 30% when equipped with a bow. Uh, featured abilities they get thunder scheme deal lightning damage and chance of blinding all enemies fight song boost attack defense magic and spirit for all allies while singing so they're like a bard then letter G reduce defense spirit and fire lightning wind and light resistance for all enemies so that could be interesting all right I know you guys uh, four star units are not that great anymore but you never know if you're starting the game you still don't have a buffer and uh, this could be pretty nice if it's something like it would be good something around like 70% that would be really really cool uh, just for newer players but we'll see when the data mine comes out we'll see a little bit uh, how they work and uh, nonetheless still a pretty fun and uh, cool looking uh, units actually because there are two guys right here it has a four star to six star then the last one Gallus uh, let's be honest he's only here for his trust master which is really really good it's a uh, big sword great sword sorry attack 130 defense plus 10 percent and it's a two-handed weapon which is really really good because you increase the damage when it's a two-handed weapon so that thing right here if you guys get plenty of him uh, make sure you get that trust master because this is actually really 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 nice then we're gonna move on to the next one you guys are gonna be introduced to the five star guaranteed 20 percent chance of getting yego or naji so basically the more you guys summon uh we're gonna go right here fast fast we're gonna go up so uh the more you summon i think that's how it works right is it here wait uh so basically players can use five star one five star guaranteed 20% Diego ticket to perform a five star guaranteed 20% Diego ticket summon. Increased chance of getting Diego. So basically, real simple. I think you're gonna have to buy this one. I think this one comes in a, uh, yeah, it's right here. How to get a five star 20%. Diego, this can be acquired by purchasing the Miscavious Marlboro bundle. So if you guys buy the bundle, you're going to be guaranteed one of those tickets. And it's going to be the same thing for Naji. Then we're going to be getting a raid event, which is also really, really good. Because we're going to be able to farm a little bit more for those rare summon tickets and some cool equipment. So uh, the orders and the Magitech runes. This is really, really cool. I like this. This is going to start on Friday. So basically, make sure you use your raid events, coins from the Xenogears guys or else you're going to be losing them. So make sure you're summoning with them. Get those Cactuars, get everything, fuse everything together. Don't forget to use them. Then, this, really good. Like any other raid, uh, raid event, you guys will be able to get limited time equipment. And this one right here is pretty nice. Yin Yang Ornament. Uh, HP 100 MP plus 50 attack and magic plus 25 and defense plus 5 it's an accessory elite dog tag another accessory boost attack and defense by 20% pretty pretty nice uh, although special ops sword attack 64 and uh, type 23 although rifle attack 56 so again guys if you are newer to this game these things right here are really good so make sure you craft them and uh, yeah, so like any other raid, raid event, oh, that's a lot of things to say. Like any other raid event, guys, uh, we will be getting those orbs and they're going to refill every hour. And we're going to be able to fight this boss and basically kill him in one turn. Then we're going to move on to the next one. Final Fantasy VI event dungeon, the floating continent. This is back. It's basically an old one and it's coming back. Sorry about that. 
Uh, basically, you guys will be get able to get some fishes to trade for the Minister Mog. I'm pretty sure Minister Mog or the King Mog. And uh, you'll you'll be able to get some rare summon tickets. Uh, I'm not sure if this one is going to refresh. So if uh, you cleared this before, if you're going to be able to clear it again. But uh, let's just wait and see. And I remember when the Tabby suit came out, came out, guys, this was really, really good. So if you guys still don't have that, uh, I strongly suggest you to get this. Unless you have it and you're an older player. But if you're a newer player, this is really, really good. These things too are really good. So make sure you get them. And the bonus unit, Transterra, will be a bonus unit 200%. You guys will be having Setzer, also regular Terra, Kefka, and Gal. So these are going to be the bonus units and also... Af energy so this thing is really cool enjoy af energy cost for chamber of the fallen chamber of the indignant indignant and chamber of arms during the campaign period so from end of maintenance on thursday may 16 all the way up to saturday june 1st you guys will be having af energy on all this stuff so that's really really cool if you guys are still missing bosses to fight and stuff like that make sure you do it with af energy that thing is amazing and also scheduled maintenance wednesday uh, May 15 this is what's gonna happen but the real question guys are you gonna be pulling for this banner I know I will not be pulling because uh, let's be honest Axtar and Xeno of the battle star just basically dried me as much as possible and uh, no more tickets no more lapis so kind of skip on these guys and let's be honest we just got three almost four good banners in a row so this is gonna have to wait and <clears throat> they're always gonna be in the summon pool so it's just two extra units we're going to be able to pull for. On this note, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Please leave a like down below. Comment also if you guys are going to be pulling. And subscribe for more, guys. On this note, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.